Hey, hey, everybody, this is Larry. This is day 28 of the Lico Day Challenge. Mm, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, join me on Discord. Let me know what you think about today's poem. 839, similar string groups. Okay, let's see what this is all about. Uh, okay, so you have two string X, Y. Uh, similar, you could swap two letters and there you go to each other. Uh, okay. Together, they... Uh, Oh, we got, oh, uh, excuse me, jeez. Mm. Okay, how many groups are there? Uh, okay, let's see. Is, is the trans, transitive properly? Notice that tall and sound, even though they're not similar. Form a, okay, so this is, um, yeah, this is, could be, how do you say this? Uh, this is, Sorry, I'm having trouble speaking clearly. Uh, but yeah, but this is a connected component or, um, you know, we're trying to find the transitive closure basically effectively. Um, given the n is equal to 300, this makes it simpler as well um, for each length was 300. So that means that you know, 300 choose 2, which is about like 45,000, right? Uh, 45 operation 5000 for each of the 300. Maybe that's good enough, is it? I don't know, maybe not, but uh, but yeah, mm. how do I want to do it? So, th so this is just connected components, and they're usually a couple of ways, right? You can. Yeah, what is 300 cube? 9 million, is it? Oh, tw 27 million. Mm, that seems a little bit high. So, mm, well, I guess it's 27 million over 6. So that's like 4 million? No, that's not over 6. This is an n choose 3. This is n choose 2 times 300. So it's actually, uh, was it 13 million or something? So, mm, so I think there are really two ways to do it, right? One is <clears throat> one is for each uh, each word. We do every possible swap and then kind of figure out the edges that way. So we have to construct the graph. The graph can have three hundred square number of nodes at, or edges at most, uh, 300 is the, the edge, but it costs 300 to kind of check for similarity. So you can either do, so there are really two ways, right? One is just brute force i and j uh, for each pairs of uh, words, see if, you know, see if they're similar, and then just do a connected components thing that way, either using breadth of search, depth of search, union find, one of those things, right? Uh, and then the other thing that you can do is um like i said for each word do um you know do a swap on every possible uh 300 choose two uh uh you know characters and then having a look up and then kind of connect it that way i'm gonna try to do the naive first and see if that's going to be fast enough uh if not i am going to be a little bit sad and then see if you know hmm. Yeah, see if that's going to be good enough. Um, okay, so, you know, maybe uh, calculate difference or something, that delta maybe, x, y, right? And this assumes that they're both the same strings um, or same length string. So then for a, b in sip of x, y, uh, let's say d is equal to zero. If a is not equal to b, then we increment by one and then we return d, right? Um, hmm. uh, yeah, okay, so that's to calculate the to see if they're similar. Um, you can, you know, if this is zero or two, then it should be good, and there should be no. There shouldn't, there shouldn't be any way that it can be just one character's different 
um, because everything is an anagram, so that should be okay. So then now you just do something like uh, n is equal to length of strings. So I'm like half sneezing or half like wanting to sneeze. That's why I'm like not talking or whatever, but uh, please forgive me. But yeah. Um, how to uh, I da, 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 right? So if they're similar, then we construct a adjacency list. <laughs> right. And now that we have this adjacency list. We can just do you know standard connected component stuff. Given the n is three hundred, I'm gonna just do it that first search this time, right? Why not? And then for i in range of n, if not visited of i, then visit of i is equal to true, and then I don't know visit i or something, right? For we in agency list of x, uh, if not visited of v, then we visit uh, visit v, visit of v is equal to true. Of course, here is where we do the in command, and then otherwise we return count. Oh, I meant collections, obviously. Hmm. I messed something up. Mm. Did I mess something up? Do dun dun. Um, oh, this is. This should be less than or equal to two. I forgot that thing. All right. Now it looks good as expected, and then. Hopefully this doesn't time out, and it doesn't. Sweet. A little bit slow, but that's fine. Uh, this is going to be n squared times l. You know, they're all 300, so it's kind of confusing to say. But, you know, this is the n squared part, and this is the o of l part, so n squared times l. But, yeah. Um, uh, but, yeah. That's all I have for this one. Let me know what you think. This is standard breath, uh, death first search, the way that I did it, which is V plus E, which is, of course, um, V square in the worst case, because that's the number of edges. So, yeah. Um, that's all I have for today. Let me know what you think. Stay good, stay healthy, take good mental health. I'll see you later and take care. Bye-bye.